Today is November 11th, 2021. For those who do not know, it is Veterans Day here in the United States. There is one confusing question for people to know. What is the difference between Veterans Day and Memorial Day? That's the first question. That's the key question. The other related question is, why Memorial Day is usually say Memorial Weekend, usually has to happen in the month of May, but it will be on Monday. But Veterans Day must appear on exactly date. Doesn't matter what day of the week. It has to be on November 11th each year. Why? And the last question I want to, this is my personal, uh, why do we say happy Veterans Day to a veteran, but in my opinion, it is not appropriate to say happy Memorial Day. Welcome everyone. My name is Ernest Bonfess Makurilo EBM from EBM Scholars. I had opportunity and honor to serve in the U.S. Navy. Honorable discharge. For that particular case, I'm a veteran. So what I'm saying is what I know, my personal experience, but the fact. Both Memorial Day and Veterans Day are honoring people who serve in the military. Let me start with that one. That is the base. That is the foundation. Both celebrations, both days are honoring people who served in the military. But there is a difference. There are those who served and they are still alive, like myself. I didn't die in the action. That is a Veterans Day. I can go to serve in the military, get out. If I die on my own life, personal, as a civilian, or die not in the action, that is a veteran, Veterans Day. If I die in the action, you die in the war, you die while you are on duty, that is memorial. That is the difference. Even though people refer, if you go to some of the readings, they refer uh, veterans is for the living, but it's not only for the living, veterans for all. If you die in the action and don't die with action, first of all, you're a veteran, but you have extra memorial because you sacrificed and died in the action so any person who died in the action their family are celebrating both they are celebrating veterans because that person is a veteran but that person we honor for the sacrifices and losing the life in the action memorial so memorial is to honor people who sacrificed and died in the action but also those people who died in action because are no longer in the military they are veterans because they served with honor. So a veteran, a, uh, a veteran is for both Memo people who died and people in the action, and even if you die out of the action or you are still alive, that is one. Memorial is only for special people who are no longer with us, died in the action. That is the major big difference. Let's go to another part. When it comes to celebration or honoring, remembering them, memorial usual is on the, it's in the month of May, it is on Monday. So usually we say memorial weekend. Usually it is a four day weekend. So you go Friday. So uh, we say uh, it will be three day weekend, whatever. So it's Saturday, Sunday and Monday off for work. But when it comes to 
uh, veterans, it has to happen on 11th of November. Why? Because the decision and declaration to end the First World War in 1918 happened at the 11th hour on the 11th day of the 11th month in the year 1918. So it was on 11 is a day, 11 is a month of November, on 11th hour when the declaration to end the war. So, despite the Versailles Peace Treaty was signed in 1919, later, but that is the declaration, official declaration of the end of the war was 18, 1918, on that particular day. So that's why the, memo uh, the Veterans Day will always be on November 11th. So today is Thursday. It is Veterans. They don't wait until to be to memoir uh, to to remember it on Monday. No. So that is in case you didn't know. And the last thing, personal, I will say Happy Veterans Day. You can say that way. But it feels awkward to say Happy Memorial Day. It doesn't look good, in my opinion. I don't know officially. But to avoid those, to use the word Happy uh, Memorial, Happy, whatever, and you, to some people will be okay, some people not okay, just say thank you for your service. Thank you for your sacrifice. Whether someone is still alive, someone died in the action. If you say thank you for your service, that matters a lot than say happy thank uh, happy uh, Veterans Day. So if you see a picture of a veteran, if you see a family that posted the picture of the person who died in the action, don't say happy Memorial Day or happy Veterans Day. Just say thank you for your service, sir. Thank you for your service, ma'am. It's enough. That's what I can simply say that way. So now you know the difference between the two. Memorial and veterans. But again, one more thing. Veterans is not a public holiday. Like we don't go to work, whatever, no. But memorial is public holiday. And sometimes it's confusing when you see people celebrating. The majority of people do not know what is memorial. They just barbecue. Let's meet you at the barbecue. They just enjoy whatever. They do not know what does memorial mean. It means a lot for this country. So while you are just giving champagne and whatever, just take one second to say thank you for those who sacrificed their life in the line of duty. But that is in May. Now is Veterans Day for those who are the opportunity to serve. Thank you so much. Thank you for your service, each and every one. And even the current people in the military who are serving, thank you for your service currently, for what you are doing to this greatest nation on the planet Earth.